in the fog is SpaceX's Starship test vehicle number 11. It was just over three weeks ago we launched number 10 from the adjacent pad at the Starbase facility in Cameron County, Texas. Now we're going to do our best to find a camera view for the webcast, but as you can see, fog is everywhere at Starbase in Texas. I don't know what's going to happen here, guys. I don't know if anyone's going to have footage of this, including SpaceX. But um, I guess we'll watch together. We'll of course keep our views live. We don't have any ground Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> plus five minutes we're passing through five kilometers a nice view from the exterior camera showing one of the flaps on the Battery starship the test vehicle number 11. altitude. One kilometer altitude. T plus 545, we've just passed through one kilometer altitude, getting ready for the relay. Hey everybody, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. We just retrieved our cameras last night from SN11 and I'm excited to share this with you. You may have noticed the directionality of the sound in the debris field scene and that's because we use a, uh, an ambisonic mic, which is a four-way directional microphone. It allows us to place the viewer in space. And we're going to talk more about some of the microphones and camera tech that we use as well as the experience of SN11 uh, in our Patreon Q&A. And big thanks to Everyday Astronaut and S. Padre and all our patrons who make this possible. Thanks so much.
like we've had another exciting test of Starship number 11. A reminder again, this is a test series to gather data on entry of the Starship vehicle uh, at subsonic speeds as it comes back to the landing zone. It does appear, though, that uh, another exciting test, as we say. Uh, we don't have any good camera views to share with you right now, so with that, we are going to bring the webcast to a close. Uh, we a quick recap, we had the nominal ascent, we maneuvered to horizontal when we got to 10 kilometers. The entry, we had some nice views from the exterior camera showing uh, the flaps were quiet as we descended, but then we had the camera freeze up as we got into the engine ignition sequence, and so we're going to have to find out from the team what happened. But with that, we'd like to thank the team, and we'll be back with you the next Starship test in the near future.